Rangers team this evening and in light of what Graham Sinus has been said about being more adventurous than Rangers were in Russia when they played Dynamo Kiev, you get a place for David Cooper in the team along with uh, Ian Durant who looked very tired on Saturday, but I look very tired on Saturday, but I think that is the strongest Rangers team that could be played under the circumstances. There is the Gornick side. There is only one major change in the side that Piotrovic is out under suspension and into his place comes Majka. Rangers have really got to give Cooper the kind of service in which he can bring the ball down, face his opponent, and that is when he is dangerous. This is Sunas. Beautiful play, Cooper. Superb individual play by both of them there. Looking for a little bit of support, and he gets that he's onside, or is he? No, he's not. Well, number six seems to steal a few yards there, Clemens. Tricky player, but well taken by Cooper. Here's Cooper. Super pass, Durant. Cooper inside. Durant going. Well, I don't think, in all honesty, you could criticize him too much. Cooper wasn't coming up quickly enough, and Ali McCoy was well covered. Imagine Cooper winning in the air. <laughs> Durant. Here's Cooper. Oh, that's a brilliant ball and just offside. What a... Oh, look at it. So many of this half now. Cooper. Oh. At his best tonight. It really is. Here's McCoy with a chance. That looks like a penalty, it is. It's a penalty kick. A brilliant move by David Cooper. It really was. He has tormented this defense time after time. And that... And a very vital one indeed. This could effectively... Long way to go yet, but it could effectively be gets it in. Put Rangers into the European Cup quarterfinals. One nothing. That is a very vital lead. Rangers now in aggregate. 4-1 up. And away goal to boot and emphatically put in there by Ali McCoy, Scotland's top goal scorer to the great delight of the 1,000 Rangers supporters who are now finding that this inclement weather is nothing much to bother about with a scoreline just like that before half just like that before half time. And there goes the half time whistle. The Rangers support Durant. Kept it in well, Sunas. Ferguson, that's a superb pass. Now, Davy Cooper. McGregor's going up as well. Cooper. Back it goes to Durant. And the ball was sliding away from him. It wasn't. Roberts again. Bit slack. Oh, that's a great goal. Really superb. Whipped down and here's McCoy on his own. Looking for a little bit of support. There it comes. Here's Cooper. Here's still Cooper. And it's just back. Kotrzeva. Superb move by Gornick. Butcher tries to get there. No, he's just passed again by Tyron of the jersey he's wearing and so proudly worn tonight. He's been battered about a bit. Done brilliantly. Now David Cooper. Here's Fleck inside and Durant. Here's Durant. Wide open it is. Here's Ferguson now for Rangers. Oh, brilliantly taken by the goalkeeper, Vlantic. The mix of skill and conviction that Rangers have shown tonight. 
that scoreline gets them into the quarterfinals of the Champions Cup. Not at all put up, didn't want to push it forward too much. Nice running forward by Durant. Here's McGregor. To Durant. Durant trying to go in and just take it away. McGregor. Ferguson. Here's McGregor. Sunnis is onside. In the dying seconds. Testing the goalkeeper. Had to be a successful night for Rangers. And there goes the final whistle. Rangers have made it to the quarterfinals of the Champions Cup. An excellent performance. That penalty goal by Alan McColes. A brilliant equaliser by...